So when I'm trying to solve harder problems when doing web development, often I will reach out to use something called a flowchart to help me visualize the steps that are needed by my system or an algorithm or just a user. I personally like using eraser.io, which is the sponsor of this short for making my flowcharts. And inside eraser, I have a flowchart that I've been working on for a side project for basically taking a YouTube ID, taking the transcripts and converting them to chapters that I can use when I start uploading videos to my channel. So the thing I really like about eraser is that all of the diagrams are typically set up using code. So I can go through here and change the code as needed, which allows me to commit the code to a repo where I can kind of maintain the changes over time on my software systems. So for example, on this ending state, what I can actually do is I can go down to the last one and I can change the shape. So I'll just go ahead and say oval because that's typically the convention for an ending state. And then I can also say icon and we have a list of all these great icons that we can pick from. I'll just go ahead and put a flag here. And going back, we can see that the diagram has been updated. So I highly recommend go check out eraser.io if you want to build out flowcharts and various other diagrams for yourself.